Hey what is up guys my name is Vishal from 404 Tech and in this video I'm going to tell you all you need to know about Cyanogen mode uh, Cyanogen mode 12.1 which is based on Android 5.1.1 so let's get started let's go to settings in settings about phone as you can see our phone is running on Android 5.1.1 which is official built in Cyanogen mode 12.1 Tap this uh, Cyanogen mode icon several times and you will find the lollipop easter egg. Tap and hold this lollipop easter egg and you will find the most difficult game of this decade. Just watch my high score. Yes, in this section I pretty much failed. Now let's talk about the performance. I have been using this room from last one day and uh, I found that this room is buttery smooth without any lag and the heating issue is also eliminated and also I have performed the on to benchmark score where I got a score of around 28,000 which is on my liking pretty less but it is stable. Now let's go to settings or in settings let's go to display and light and in display and light you will find a new tweak which is called as live display so what does it basically do is it optimizes the screen temperature depending upon the time of your day for example now let me switch it to night so if i switch it to my screen te temperature color got rise and if i choose to automatic or off my screen temperature become normal now let's go to now let's go to privacy under privacy you will find a privacy card this is one of the most coolest feature of Cyanogen mode 12.1 let's consider a facebook app just tap and hold the facebook app and you will find how many permissions the facebook is right now accessing so depending upon your mood you can change it for example i don't want to i don't want facebook to access my location and my camera so i will just uh, drop down it and change it to ignore so this is a, one of the most coolest feature and it will also make your phone pretty safe and secure now regarding the general tweak if you go to the app drawer you will find that now we have a vertical scrolling instead of horizontal and also if you have a ton of app then you can use the alphabetical slider uh, to navigate through to the apps real quickly so if you don't like this uh, settings you can always change it to page so that you will get the previous app drawer with white background i don't like this white background so i will just change it to the normal vertical settings now also in material design section the dialer also got revised as you can see it is completely looks new and the receiving animation is also changed so as you can see right now i am calling right and another another revision which took place is in camera uh, so uh, just open camera under camera go to settings and in settings uh, uh, if you choose the size to 720p you will find that under slow motion you will have two options slow motion at 60 frames per second and high speed 60 frames per second so the high speed 60 frames per second is a new feature which is added in this room also the least discussed feature of this room is that is time lapse which at this end of this video i will so you can just check it out it is very cool if you find this video very useful please hit on the like button and also subscribe to our channel for more such content till now this is vishal from 404 tech so have a good day and and peace for humanity